good afternoon today's sunday november 29th and <laughs> i didn't vlog any this morning it was a pretty boring day we didn't do anything special so i didn't think y'all wanted to see us clean so i didn't vlog well right now i am on my way to pick up my christmas tree and my ornaments because we're going to finally put the christmas tree up we were supposed to do this friday so we're two days late and then we're headed to the Dollar Tree because they've got the cutest mini coffee cups for the kids. And when we put up our Christmas tree, I want us to drink hot cocoa. And we're going to put on some Christmas music on YouTube. So it's going to be like really festive this evening. So that's what we're going to do. Should be pretty, pretty fun night. The kids have been out of school for a week. So we have to get back on our routine. They go back to school tomorrow. And this has seen like the longest week ever ever like three day weekends are bad the whole week off at a time <laughs> it just gave me a flashback of summer i'm a proponent for all year round school but i don't think they're going to get that down here anytime soon okay guys so yeah let me go get the christmas tree and our ornaments and we'll check back in later god out of dollar tree i could be the group for christmas He's talking about what he's gonna be for Christmas. Yeah. What was your first idea? Santa and the other kids will be Rudolph. <laughs> so he's gonna be Santa Claus, and the other kids are gonna be the reindeer. And then what's another one? Mm, I saw it after this. I forgot the name. Besides the Grinch. Wait, wait, so what um, would the other kids? Frosty. Frosty. Be? Frosty yeah. snowman. So what would the other kids be? Snowman. He would be the big snowman, and they would be the small ones. <laughs> Life with Isaiah is never a dull moment. So we went to Dollar Tree. I might as well go ahead and do my haul while I'm in the car. What we get? Yeah. Besides your snack. Mm -hmm. We got see. this. this. Oh, let's see. He's, he's going to do our haul for us today. Hold on. Yeah. Got, what do we get? I love <laughs> my carpet. Carpet room. Deodorizer. Deodorizer. They're carpet Deodor fresh. Yeah, We're going to keep fresh. it simple. Those are just his snacks. Oh, candles. This, this candle's the best. Hold on. Guys, we have Dollar Tree. Go and get this. Then, uh oh, it's what is this? It pumpkin spice. Oh my God, it smells like Christmas. We've already had the conversation. Of what smells like Christmas? Then we got these cups for the babies. They are mini coffee cups. Oh my goodness. Let's see. He's a bad hauler. Look at that. They're like half the size of a regular coffee cup. So we're gonna wash them out, and they're gonna get there. He picked that one out. <laughs> um, we're going to um put their hot cocoa in there, and then we've got. We got a snowman, a Santa Claus, and we got um, yeah, another snowman. Another snowman, but this one looks like that. So yep, that's our Dollar Tree haul. And then, of course, no trip to the Dollar Tree would be complete without Isaiah getting snacks. So yeah, he got him some snacks in, in the bag. So we are about to go get the other kits from my mom's house. Well, the girls, uh, Elijah and Bam stayed at the apartment so we're gonna go get um the girls because we picked up the christmas tree and the ornaments and we're just gonna have a good old night um i have agreed to watch this three hour youtube video with isaiah on animal crossing so that's what we're gonna watch while we're putting up the christmas tree and if you can't hear me it's because he's crack -a lacking in the background <laughs> so we are huge animal crossing fans in our house and if you have not played Animal Crossing, I suggest you don't start because it could get pretty addicting. But yeah. So that's what we're going to do. We have made a compromise. You're going to watch the three-hour YouTube video on Animal Crossing. It's called Happy Home Designer? Yes. Happy Home Designer. So yeah. <laughs> Price something? Okay guys, we're getting ready to put up our Christmas tree and I'm in the process of Y'all can talk, just don't talk so loud. I mean, y'all are not in the country hollering across the field somewhere. But I'm in the process of making hot cocoa for me and the kids because we're about to put the Christmas tree. I showed this thing last week. I picked this up. This is uh, the Ghirardelli Premium Hot Cocoa. It's chocolate caramel, so I can't wait to try that. It's different. Instead of using hot water, we have to use milk. So, I'm about to use milk. We're going to top it with some whipped cream and 
some chocolate syrup. I'm going to put cinnamon on top of my whipped cream. And then these are the baby cups that I've got for the smaller kids. See, our cups <laughs> are that big, and then their cups is itty bitty. So that's really cute. I'm about to do that, and then y'all can watch us put up our Christmas tree. <laughs> Hopefully we can do it without any meltdowns and arguments. We're just going to woosa and put up this tree, guys. Because every year, it's an event. <laughs> so we put five cups of milk in here, and it's supposed to be 15 tablespoons of this Ghirardelli cocoa mix. It's not um, mixing. So hopefully this incorporates once the milk starts getting warm. Because look at that, y'all. It's just floating on the top. So yeah. Mm -mm. That better uh, incorporate. Get beautiful. You eating your bean beans? You're eating your bean beans? Is it good? Yeah. We're eating our, or drinking our hot cocoa. We've got water bottles for days. And this is mine. I'm waiting for it to cool off. Oh, you know she got your back. It's delicious. The Ghirardelli. I do recommend it. You may have to add a little bit more chocolate of your own into it. But overall, it's pretty good. You like it, Bammy? What did you put in your hot cocoa? Sure, you go uh, marshmallows, so I mixed it up and it made white brown. What did you put in your hot cocoa? Um, some um, marshmallows, some chocolate, and some whipped cream. Some whipped cream. Mm -hmm. And we'll just send the claws. What did you put in yours? A couple of marshmallows and cinnamon. Yeah. I know he's under the table. He doesn't want to be filmed. He just doesn't know. I won't film him. But did you get him? You want to break in love? No. You want some more bean beans? You want some more bean beans? Huh? Hey guys, these are my ornaments. I've been using these for the past. This is my third year using them. Um, my favorite bird is peacock. So I made my uh, Christmas tree peacock theme. So I have green ornaments, the blue ornaments, I have purple ornaments, and then I have gold. And then my mom picked these up for me last year after Christmas, 50% off. So I think these are like angels, and I've got some blue peacocks. I've already got um, the green ones. So she got me some blue ones, and then she got me some icicles. So all of this is not going to fit on the tree, but... Um, we're going to put the majority on it.
tree is done and baby girl fell asleep right under it. And it was all decorated by just the kids. <laughs> it looks amazing. It's gorgeous. I know a lot of people are like really particular about how they place the ornaments on their trees and wanting the ornaments to be perfect. But every single year I sit on the floor and I hand the kids the ornaments and they place them on the tree where they want them to go. And they take so much pride in doing that. And I think that's special because I know I'm a lot of families that uh, the grown-ups put the ornaments on the tree so it can look just right. But my tree looks perfect because my kids did it. So I'm really happy. It turned out it's beautiful. And this was her first year being able to really enjoy Christmas. So she fell asleep under the tree. All right, guys, I'm going to end this vlog. Um, you probably can't see me because of the lighting, <laughs> but today, all in all, was a pretty successful day. We have our tree up, and the kids are super excited, and that's all I can ask for. So I hope you guys are starting to get into the Christmas spirit now that Thanksgiving is over and December is knocking at our door, literally, one day away. And until tomorrow, guys, good night. Our tree says goodnight, too. <laughs>